Queenstown. Near the centre of New Zealand's South Island is the gateway to stunning fjords, glaciers, ski fields and vineyards. This idyllic lakeside city has achieved worldwide fame as the country's adrenaline capital. When the morning sun warms the earth, the fog lifts, revealing the vivid hues of Lake Wakatipu and the city of Queenstown. The Māori call this lake Hollow of the Giant, which according to legend was formed by the resting shape of a fearsome mountain giant. Because the lake's waters rise and fall rhythmically throughout the day, it's said that his heart still beats on. It's certainly true that Queenstown is the beating heart of New Zealand's South Island, providing the pulse that keeps this remote corner of the world energetic and youthful. As the descendants of fierce Polynesian warriors and determined European settlers, the Kiwis have the spirit of adventure running through their veins. To learn more about Lake Wakatipu and the region's early settlers, head to Steamer Wharf and climb aboard the TSS Urnslaw. Nicknamed the Lady of the Lake, for over a hundred years, this steamship hasn't missed a beat, transporting livestock and passengers to and from the high country. Back in Queenstown, soak up the Aotearoa sunshine on a sandy beach or take a stroll through the idyllic Queenstown gardens which jut out into the lake. For a bird's eye view, ride the Skyline Gondola to Bob's Peak. After taking in the sweeping views of Lake Wakatipu and the Remarkables, ride, hike, slide or glide back down the mountain. When the sun gets low, head to Marine Parade and enjoy Mother Nature's spectacle with kindred spirits from all over the world. Queenstown is filled with cosy cafes, craft breweries, restaurants and bars where locals and travellers exchange tales after a day out in the wilds. Queenstown expands and contracts with the rhythm of the seasons. After a hectic summer, residents relax and slowly transform the town into a world-class ski destination. By July, the winter sports season is in full swing. Queenstown has three main ski fields, each with its own charms and highlights. The remarkable ski field is just 35 minutes drive from Queenstown and features runs for the seasoned freestylers and beginners. Cadrona Alpine Resort is located towards the town of Wanaka. The more advanced terrain parks and half pipes here are among the biggest in the southern hemisphere and meet Olympic standards. A 20 minute drive from the city is the Coronet Peak ski area, a spectacular resort offering thrilling roller coaster terrain and a dedicated learner area. After a few hours on the slopes, enjoy a hearty meal with a view. And when the weekend comes, why not linger and enjoy the park after dark? When the snow finally melts, Queenstown transforms once again to accommodate a new wave of visitors who flock to the Arrow Basin in spring and summer to taste the flavours of the high country and explore its charming historic towns. Back 
in the 1870s, Chinese prospectors tried their luck in nearby creeks, establishing the community of Arrowtown. A century later, the Kiwis struck gold at Kawarau Bridge, the spot where bungee jumping was first brought to the world. Even if your heart's not into taking the leap, it's still exciting to watch. On your way back to Queenstown, you'll cross the Shotover River, where the always daring Kiwis challenge you once more. Jump into a jet boat and hang on for a heart-stopping thrill ride through the river's breathtakingly narrow canyons. The Kiwis have taken their cues from their dramatic surroundings to create one of the world's most spectacular adventure playgrounds. But at the same time, the locals know when it's time to slow down, unwind, and enjoy the finer things in life, like wine. Queenstown and the nearby Gibston Valley are home to 75 wineries. Here, vintners produce Pinot Noirs acclaimed for their purity, freshness and vitality, a perfect reflection of the region itself. Some travellers live to push their heart rates to the limit. Some prefer to align theirs with the gentler rhythms of nature, while others are open to it all. No matter what your style, when it's time to say goodbye to Queenstown, your heart is sure to ache. Which is why, year after year, so many return.